Hi everyone, it's Lonnie. Welcome back to May Bible Journal. We are on day 25 and the prompt today is make or maker. And I chose Psalm 121. I lift up my eyes to the hills. From where does my help come? My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. He will not allow your foot to slip. Your protector will not slumber. Behold, the pr protector of Israel will neither slumber nor sleep. The Lord is your keeper. The Lord is the shade on your right hand. The sun will not strike you by day nor the moon by night. The Lord will guard you from all evil. He will preserve your soul. The Lord will watch over your coming and going, both now and forevermore. I forgot to write down which translation I used for that, but it might have been the Berean Study Bible. Anyways, my help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. I like that verse because there is no room for who made the heaven and the earth. He comes right out and says that he is the creator. I also like this because it talks about Israel. And I think we would do well in these times to remember who and what is important to God. God loves Israel. He calls Israel the apple of his eye. If you go after the apple of someone's eye, what do you think will happen? I guarantee that the results will not be good, will not be favorable. So, if someone were to ask me whose side I was on, I would say I'm on the Lord's side. Right or wrong what Israel does or anybody does. He loves the whole world, which is why Jesus died for everyone. But Israel is a special treasure, peculiar treasure. Anyways, everybody is having input on that, so I guess that's mine. Um, another reason I like the psalm, it's very soothing. If he doesn't sleep where Israel's concerned, he's not going to slumber nor sleep where his children are concerned. So he watches over us. When I saw what it said about um, he will preserve your soul, I got this image of a jar. You know how you, well, I don't know if we still do it, but some people still do it. We put things in a jar to keep them, to preserve them. So when I read, he will preserve my soul, um, I got this picture of a jar with my soul in it. And my soul consists of mind, will, and emotions. So the only way to get on the Lord's side is through Jesus. Because Jesus said the only way to the Father is through him. And then he will show you what to do from there. Because Jesus said to love. Love your neighbor as yourself. I'm just giving this a bit of a shadow.
He will preserve your soul. The Lord will watch over your coming and going, both now and forevermore. I pray that blesses you and that you'll have a good day. Thanks for tuning in today and we'll see you again. Bye for now.